Hi, welcome to SBR Sports Picks. I'm Peter Loshak. Sitting next to me, Mike Brenner. Today is July 18th, and we are going to take a look at the uh, at Oklahoma State right now. Preview Woo! Oklahoma State for 2016 in the Big 12. This is a very interesting team, Mike Brenner. Yeah. They're uh, you know they they kind of like uh, they have they draft like they get like top 40 talent, but they, they we usually expect them to be like top 25. Sometimes when they're at their when they're playing their best, they're top 15 or top 10. Yes. Uh, you know this year they have uh, they have an offense that looks like it's going to be explosive in the passing game. Uh, some questions. On defense, though, and last year, you know, they they, they started out uh, really strong, but they couldn't really hang with the uh, with, with the top teams when they played, uh, you know, top competition, legit yeah. top fifteen, top ten teams. Yeah. They wilted. They really got blown out. What do we expect from this year? I'm not exactly sure. The team total is eight and a half. The over minus one hundred five, under minus one twenty five, and uh, they're the third choice, far back uh, to win the Big Twelve. They're just the third choice, but at seven to one, TCU is about six to one. And then Oklahoma, of course, yeah. is the uh, favorite at minus one twenty. What do you think, Pistol Pete? I think there's no reason this team can't compete completely uh, mm -hmm. with Oklahoma. Like yeah, I do. I, okay. I like them. They got 10 offensive starters coming back yeah. on a good offense, yes. and like you yes. said, very explosive. And even though that defense hurt them, especially in the second half last year, they got eight defensive starters coming mm -hmm. back to build right. off of the momentum that they had early on last year. So yes. I think this team has an opportunity that's rather unique, and again, it, it, it hinges on staying healthy. But if they yes. stay healthy, this team's going to cash some tickets, and yeah. I'm looking for them to cash a lot of over tickets, Pistol Pete. Yeah, I mean, uh, the question is just uh, it's just they're the kind of team that, that, that I like to bet as a big favorite against like mid-range teams they clearly outclass. Yes, but my yes. sense is that when they step up in class, I don't like to bet them as an underdog. I feel like they get blown out when they. Uh, I have I don't have their schedule. In no, front of me, so and I'm not no, sure I do. Yeah. Well, they're facing some big boys, you know. Yeah, they when they face the big boys, I'm, yep. I'm tending to, uh, to to bet against them even when they're a big underdog. Would you but TCU, you know, no, you're right, yeah. and that's been their pattern. Yeah. And uh, last year also, I cashed a lot of first half tickets with them early in the yeah. season. Second half, it hurt me. But I think they got TCU and Oklahoma right near each other in the schedule this year. And I think they can, and Texas Tech as well, who can be dangerous, yeah. I think they can compete with all three of them this year. Now, Oklahoma, I don't think they're going to be able to get it done. Uh, but I think they can definitely uh, match up easily with TCU. And West Virginia, I think they're going to be, uh, uh, there's a, a game to look out for. And I don't mean against them. I'm yeah. saying there's one I think they're going to be undervalued in that game against West Virginia. Yeah, I mean, I would definitely look for uh, look for matchups where, where the opposing uh, teams don't really have the defense to yes. stop. Them. And, and then that's, when, that's when, why when, I pulled right. that one. Yeah. And then when the, and then when that is the case, forget about it. It's not like their offense is going to be a little bit better than, than what you expect. They're going to be a lot better and have yes. explosive games. So yep. I feel like when when they their 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 offense might be slowed down by by truly elite defenses that know how to stop them. But against mid range teams that can't stop them, they'll put yes. up uh, and they'll be good bets on the overs on the team total overs yeah. to cover as a big favorite. Uh, so yeah, I would agree with you on that one. And uh, and you would even uh, like when they play Oklahoma, you you think they're going to be a little bit undervalued. In I do, one, and okay? I think they'll. Stay stick right in there because of the experience. And mm -hmm. the other thing that you touched on was the other thing I was going to say was team totals mm -hmm. as far as their points. Yeah. Their points. I'm going to be all over that. Uh, this Especially is gonna... against mid-range and yes. low-range. Even yes. when the team total is like 40 or higher. Yeah, Because they know also they're going to have to take advantage of those opportunities to put as many points on the board as they can. Because at the end of the year when it comes, you know, comes time to be getting, you know, sent to the bowl games and everything, they're going to be looking at that strength of schedule. Yeah. So. That's what I'm thinking. All right. And as far as the uh, the uh, eight and a half. Yeah. You know, doable. This, this, it, it's certainly doable. This is a team that, like, with luck, they go ten and three. If they have bad luck with turnovers and injuries, they go seven and six. Yeah, so, uh, exactly. It feels like a coin flip to me. I guess I would have a slight lean to the over. What is the over? What's that? Eight at? and a half. The over is minus one hundred five. Minus one hundred five. I love it. Yeah, I love it. Love, I think that's an over. over. Yeah. Yep, I'm taking it, and I think they're going to establish very early some confidence that they had last year, and I think they're just going to rebound on that. If they stay healthy, look out. It's going to be right. a dangerous team. But if that quarterback Rudolph gets injured, oh gets, yeah, that could uh, go south whole real quick. New ball game. Whole exactly. new ball game. All right. Exactly. Exactly. They were, and one thing to uh, keep in mind, last year they were definitely very lucky uh, on, on turnovers and fumbles and stuff like that. Yeah. Uh, and they won a lot of uh, close games. So, yeah. uh, you know, with, with a little bit of, uh, of luck going the other way, they could easily have. have exactly. Had, like, and a stat three. like that is hard to, to, to repeat year in and year yes. out. So yes. that's a very good piece of information there, Pistol Pete. Uh, Speaking of good information, how about that OCDPicks.com? Yeah, that's a, that's a site that uh, our company started to take advantage of uh, the popularity of our shows that we Absolutely. keep doing, right? OCDPicks.com. That's right. Hit that like button. Always on the go? Bet365 has one of the top mobile platforms in today's market. Sign up today and don't let your busy life keep you out of the game.